What's the people? Welcome to this video, guys. So, if you saw this video, you kind of know what this video will be all about. If you haven't seen it, maybe go and watch it or you stay tuned and try to figure out. Maybe you're a smart boy and can figure out all by yourself. And I will be explaining everything as well, so you don't have to watch it. But, I mean, I, you can watch it for my sake if you want to help me out. You know, I will wait. You know, I, I will wait. Here you go. Oh, you're back. Oh, hello. I missed you. I can't. I did not miss you. Okay, that's a weird start to a video. If you saw that video, you probably know that... No, actually, if you saw that video, you do know, okay? The Tencent started banning YouTubers and videos because they had hackers in the videos. Because they had maybe the title hackers or because they mentioned hackers in some kind of a way. So because of that, they removed the videos and gave the YouTubers a copyright strike. So I made a video about that, talking about it. I was like, this is not okay. We gotta change this. And so... That's pretty much what that video is about. And now, just two days ago, I actually talked to PUBG Mobile about this. After they, they saw this video, and they were like, shit, we gotta talk to Panda. So they did that. But we talked about that, and we also talked about hackers and a lot of other different things, which I'm gonna be telling you in this video, guys. So first of all, the reason why a lot of these videos was taken down, according to what they said, is that a person from Tencent, I think, which did not really have the authority to copyright strike videos, did that. So now PUBG Mobile is trying to remove all of these strikes. And from what I know, all of the ones which I mentioned in the last video has been fixed. I think so, at least. I know two of them are gone. I think Riggs Gaming's actually waited all the days for it to be removed, which is... It shouldn't be like that. So either way, I've talked to them and they said that they're gonna remove all the strikes which were made, okay? They also said that making videos on hackers, showing hackers uh, in your videos is, you know, obviously we are allowed to do that. Obviously, it would be weird for us not allowed to do that. And for someone trying to silence us, they even told me to actually go ahead and do it. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. Every single video from now on will only be hackers. Okay, no. <laughs> maybe, we will see. Maybe more hackers will appear and I will be making videos on them. Because now I'm, I'm not afraid to do it, okay? I'm not afraid to get a strike. I'm actually a bit afraid to get a strike. Hopefully I will not get that though. Tencent, I'm looking at you. Either ways, like I said, they told that they were gonna be removing them. But they also said that they didn't really know all the videos which was taken down. So if you're a smaller YouTuber, which maybe doesn't have a big voice, comment down below on this video and say that your videos has been striked. And I will make sure that PUBG Mobile checks out your channel to go ahead and fix that strike. Because that ain't right. I might help you, okay? I will do whatever I can. Getting a strike sucks, so I will try to help you, all right? I also mentioned in this video that I think PUBG Mobile hates me because they never talked to me, never said anything. Well, now they have, obviously. They have talked to me now. And pretty much what they said is that they kind of focus on smaller YouTubers to help them. And they kind of saw me as this almighty king of YouTube. And they're like, we do not even deserve to speak to this almighty panda. They didn't say that. Uh, they thought I didn't really need the help because I can carry it all by myself. Huh? I've been carrying myself for these past couple of years. I didn't need any help from PUBG Mobile. I've been carrying myself, okay? I don't need your help. Wait, why do I have Arena of Nara? Okay. A lot of you guys have been asking me, why do you have a Reno Valor shirt? Well, I got it once and I think it's comfortable. That's the only reason, okay? That's literally the only reason. I'm not sponsoring anything. I just, it's a comfortable shirt, okay? But yeah, that's kind of uh, this video. I just wanted to tell you guys, they're working through removing all the strikes. They did not really mean intentionally to do that. Someone which did not really have the authority did it. Now they're trying to fix all of that. And like I said also, we talked a bit about hackers. And they told me that they're doing their best to remove hackers. Like we saw here before, they removed 2 million hackers. And apparently removing hundreds of thousands of uh, hackers every day and they're also removing all of these ads that are promoting these hacks so they are actually doing something and I believe them some people might not believe them because they still see hackers in the game but I do believe that they're removing the hackers we all know that PUBG Mobile and Tencent they want to make money and obviously having a lot of hackers in the game will not make them money okay if you play a game and there's a lot of hackers and you just die from hackers you will stop playing the game and obviously they want people to play the game so they're trying to remove the hackers and that is why I think they are not lying about this. I think they're telling the truth and also they're showing us stats about them removing hackers. So thank you for doing that. Thank you for reaching out to me. Thank you for speaking with us, the community. It's great. If anything ever would be to happen again, I would go ahead and update you guys on PUBG Mobile stuff and relate. Uh, okay. And if you have any questions directly to PUBG Mobile, comment that down below if you're wondering something. Maybe I can ask it. Maybe I can because now I can actually speak with them. It only took two years. 
but now I can do it, okay? Maybe I, I'm not receiving cakes like this guy. Maybe I'm not getting promotions like all of these people. Uh, but I can talk to them, so that's, that's always something. No, I'm not mad about that it took two years. <laughs> they only reached out to me because I complained, you know? Thanks. They did actually say that uh, they had followed me, and they know who I am. I was apparently the first person that they followed on. I... But yeah, that was all for this video, I guess. I have nothing more to say. Hope you enjoyed this Thank you for watching. I'm tired. Okay, bye. <laughs> this video was sponsored by Amazon App Store. Wait, 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 wait! Do you want to save money when buying UC in PUBG? Or save money in any other mobile game? Well, go ahead and use Amazon Coins. By using Amazon Coins, you can save as much as 20%. That's a good deal. It's very simple. All you have to do is download Amazon App Store, download PUBG Mobile from the Amazon App Store, log into PUBG Mobile, you won't lose any information or any data whatsoever, and then you can go and use the coins from Amazon App Store to get it cheaper, okay? I've also made a full tutorial on this, links and that will be in the description, as well as the Amazon App Store in the description. Bye.